Hello and welcome to the MBS show, episode number 393. I am your host, Roman Sanzo, and well, we got a show for you, we got some news, and since it's what, December, there's a lot of quote-unquote toys and whatnot, not really, um, you, you'll see what I mean when we get into the news. So, uh, let's not delay deadly and let's hop right into it. So, first news is uh, new models for giant pony statue over in Asia. So, apparently, uh, we have some pony figures or statues over in Asia. I'm not sure which region. Uh, but this does correlate to the previous one that we saw a while back. Uh, remember where they were building a bunch of those giant statues? So uh, for this one, I, I think this is correlates to that where um, Hasbro commissioned this factory to create pony figures and they did and now they're distributing it to stores all around the world so it does that <laughs> that does make sense other than that i got no idea where because personally for me i live in malaysia and i haven't seen any of this yet so i, I guess i'll just have to wait and see maybe there's place i'm sorry <laughs> maybe they're going to display at um the toy section in some toy stores or whatever it is so yeah i'm just guessing that it will be there around somewhere uh, as for now we only have two pictures uh, one of applejack and rainbow dash and they look good they look on model you can see that applejack here has her stats and hat and her mane and tail looks perfect so does rainbow dash and this is just awesome uh we I see that it's in front of Mark and Spencer, so this have to be that it is in the middle of the mall, like in the centerpiece, something like that. Um, so clues for where this could be is that um, there's Chinese text probably saying do not lean. So maybe it's in China or Hong Kong. So probably those two places there, probably, I don't know. But still awesome, much awesomeness. And talking about toy stores, I'm just going to make some show notes here a bit. Um, New Jersey Toys <laughs> Toys R Us to, returns with new New Jersey store. Wow, that's a mouthful. New Jersey, with New Jersey store. Okay, so remember a while back when we mentioned or when we reported that Toys R Us closed down and they had to file for bankruptcy and whatnot and they're trying to rebuild it so apparently they have a new store in new jersey so yay awesomeness other than that i got no idea um it does i haven't read through anything here yet i'm just assuming the store is big from what i can tell they have a um it says here that they have a full running nerf tr nerf demo station which is cool which is cool if you play nerf uh, from what I'm seeing here you can see here that they have a glass barrier with some target boards and I'm guessing you should stand here and shoot at the boards and stuff wow that's, that nerf ultra is big uh, I wonder do they <laughs> I wonder if they have the overwatch thing uh, i don't see it but i do see some fortnite stuff hmm. but yeah um that's awesome toys R Us is back so probably you'll see pony figures there like the statuette from the previous news this one probably but yay good on you guys having a toys R Us back just hope that it will keep growing Running a toy store is not easy in this day and age, especially with the Amazons, the Ebays, the online buyers and sellers. So yeah, not easy. But let's move on to the next news. And 
still on the trend of quote unquote toys, um, this year's Hallmark My Little Pony ornament is questionable at best. And yeah, what? See, I'm used to companies doing cheap stuff for cheap just to earn a buck. I'm used to it. I'm used to it and it's something that I've gotten used to. But the problem is, if you've done work previously and it looks something like this, you, you have to question yourself, what happened? What on earth happened to your quality that you guys pop this one out? Like, what? This is... Uh, nee. I'm not even sure what to say. But, as usual, if you want to, you can get it on the... Um, Hallmark store? Oh no, Target. For seven dollars? Ugh, I would pay one for this. Oh, there, there's some other figures too. There's some other figures too. Yeah. You got Rex. At least that one looks passable. Oh, you Frozen? Yeah, there's Frozen there if you want to. Yeah. So, yeah. What happened to your quality? Gosh. And last one on the news is uh, Ubuntu plugs uh, plug in. The pony on Twitter, followed by a hater bomb. Hmm. Well, <sighs> I'm just gonna break this down for a bit. For you guys who got no idea what Ubuntu is, um, Ubuntu is a Linux distro or distribution. And what Linux is, is an alternate form of operating system for your computer. The most popular one right now or tied to is Windows followed by Macintosh and then Linux and Linux has multiple versions uh, there's Red Hat and there's also uh, Unix and then there's also Ubuntu and so on but uh, Ubuntu seems to be the one that everybody's going because of how easy it is but anywho, um, they plugged in a few. Uh, sorry, they 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 recently plugged in the uh, app called Pony Says. Oh, okay, Pony Says. So yeah, here it is. You can install it. Why not? I don't have it, so I got no idea. But anywho, uh, on the Twitter says, you know what Ubuntu really needs more ponies. Install Pony Says from the Snap Store, and you can help fix this important problem snap install pony says and uh, I'm not interested in sure what this is but it looks fun but as per usual haters are gonna hate because well they don't like ponies eh? but there's a lot of support too because with every fandom there's gonna be the positive and negatives and sometimes the negatives outweigh the positive and in this case the negatives are getting buried by the good love and a lot of people are replying with okay uh, they're taking one step further with uh, icons and whatnot and that is really awesome for the community and I don't run Ubuntu so I got no idea but this looks like a fun fun tool uh, by the way, if I'm not mistaken, Ubuntu is free. I think. Uh, free in the so sense of its... Uh, what's the word? Shareware or... Not really share. It's, I, I don't remember, but... Um, it's available and you can try it out if you want to. So, that's the news for this week because I'm out of news. But anywho... Um, well, let's go with what happened with my week. And my week has been pretty okay. Um, I haven't been doing anything special, but I did try a new game. Um, I really hate to say this, but I've been playing a mobile game. <laughs> uh, said mobile game is called Teppen. It is the 
Capcom vs. Capcom card fighting game. Not really card fighting game, it's like card battle game similar to those Yu Gi Oh's, Magic the Good Ring, and also Pokemon's. So, yeah, it's similar to that. Other than that, um, I recently bought Resident Evil 2 on the PC, so yay. Haven't really played it yet. Install it, need to play it. Mm. Uh, other than that, um, tap in. It's free, you should try it if you're a big Capcom fan. I am, and I'm enjoying it without even paying a buck. It's mobile game, so you'll get bored soonish. I'm still in the honeymoon phase where, oh, I like this game, this game is fun. Just wait a month or two and I'll just probably uninstall it. Yeah. Other than that, uh, I haven't really watched any new movies, haven't really been doing anything significantly important. But other than that, yeah, just a lot of work and a lot of things that I need to do like editing and do show notes and whatnot like a lot of work and personal work and whatnot yeah but anywho uh, let's wrap it up because well we've reached the end and i got nothing more to add so anywho uh let's see if you have any questions, concerns, or suggestions for the show, you can contact us at the uh, mbshowgmail.com. You can also reach us on the Twitter. The show's Twitter account is at the MBS Show. My personal Twitter account is at Norman Sanzo. And please subscribe and rate us on iTunes, YouTube. And don't forget to press the bell icon to stay up to date. And switch radio and also like our Facebook page. You can also catch us on live.com. Links are in the show notes. Uh, if you would like to support the show, you can do so at patreon.com slash the MBS show where with every support you'll get uh, weeks early access to review and discussion podcasts, exclusive and deleted content. And a huge thank you from me. Talking about thank yous, I would like to thank... Give me a second. <laughs> Alright, I'd like to thank Amy, Lucky Knight, Esther Flag, Tristan and also Jeffrey. Thank you so much guys, you are great. So anyway, I have been Norman Sanzo, and I'll catch you guys next week with a, another fun episode of the MBS Show. See ya!